Hello, this is the Multimodal Project for Hot Topic. I'm Kelsey Warning, a student at Miami University. Hot Topic is a store focused on selling popular culture-based merchandise, especially clothing. This store is massive, with stores in every single state in the U.S. They currently have over 600 stores. Their demographics are teenagers and 20-somethings, mostly white. They also tend to be considered nerds. Hot Topic has a connection with many franchises. Most popular franchises have created contracts with Hot Topic to sell merchandise based on the franchises. Hot Topic sells these merchandise with connections to several well-known franchises like Harry Potter and Marvel Comics. One example is on the screen with an anniversary tee for all-time low. Hot Topic's core strategy is Hot Topic expresses interest in pop culture that helps creative teenagers find their true selves through unique and creative merchandise that can be worn. The messaging framework is when a user first lands on the site, we want them to look at the items and feel inspired by the designs. After spending several minutes on the site, the users feel more understood due to their similar interests. The content on social media provides what they need to show in items that they're interested in. According to the content strategy report for Hot Topic, the first finding is that Hot Topic needs more work with diversity in general and with their posts specifically. We're going to look at Hot Topic's Instagram account primarily. Hot Topic's social media posts with people in it typically involve white females. There are a few pictures of actual diversity, but they usually involve white people with disabilities or something similar. For example, this is one of the posts from Hot Topic's Instagram. It's a picture of a woman in a wheelchair. This is a repost from hashtag Hot Topic Fanatics that shows off Hot Topic merchandise. Although it does show diversity, it focuses mainly on a white woman. As shown in this post, most of their posts tend to show white women, usually of a skinnier frame. There isn't much diversity in these posts, and those that do show diversity, such as the last slide, tend to be rare. Another way that Hot Topic can work more in diversity is through expansion of ideas. They focus on different aspects of their merchandise online versus in-store. For example, their tagline is music, pop culture, fashion, but they don't focus on fashion as much in their social media as their tagline would make it seem. Finally, they focus on particular fandoms online that could be expanded to more general popular fandoms. One example is a Twitter post from Hot Topic that focuses on one particular singer. Despite being somewhat well-known, a lot of people don't know who she is, and therefore this post will be less liked by certain users. Finding number two is that Hot Topic needs work in reaching other underdeveloped demographics. Their main demographics are white teenagers who are considered nerds. But the general population of white teenagers who aren't considered nerds feel excluded from Hot Topic's community. There are several reasons why many teenagers within their demographics don't feel included at Hot Topic. One of the reasons is that their store tends to look dark and emo. With the focus on particular fandoms and this dark atmosphere, many teenagers feel like it's a tight-knit community that isn't welcoming to others. Hot Topic store is stereotyped as emo, and some of their merchandise doesn't help. For example, they sell more merchandise that is considered emo, like the band My Chemical Romance. With the dark setup, it can feel unwelcoming. I have five recommendations to help Hot Topic advance their social media further and gain more followers. First, they should expand on fandoms and platforms. Second, they should continue using hashtags that are viewer-related, like hashtag Hot Topic Fanatics. Third, they should use devices that help interact with users, like quizzes, Ask Me Anything, Instagram Live, or others. Fourth, they should use their logo to introduce themselves before they post anything in their Instagram stories. Finally, they should make their atmosphere more welcoming. Overall, with a few changes on their social media to make themselves appear more welcoming to different audiences and easier to interact with, their social media presence will grow. Thank you for listening to my presentation.